Hey guys, Kid Guru here today for the Tech World. Today I have a new uh, website for you guys to show you. Uh, one that's integrated to Twitter, so twitter.com. Obviously, where you push out your status updates, and for me, it's twitter.com slash kidguru. And I want to show you one that you can use to tweet. Kind of, it's an automated tweeting service, and it tweets your RSS feed. So it feeds your blog or whatever RSS you stick in there to your Twitter account. So, uh, for example, if I, was, I, I have mine set up for my Tech World blog at adrianstech.com, to post to Twitter anytime uh, there's a new post, it updates every hour. You can set that differently. So you can set it to post. I set mine to post every hour, look for a new post, and put it out there. Not only that, it uses bit.ly links to track it so I know how many clicks I got. So, for example, in my last article, I only got four clicks to Twitter, and I just recently wrote this article uh, not too long ago. So, this uh, must have productivity apps for iPhone and iPod Touch. So it shows you the links, uh, stats right there, and I also have it, you can even do it for your podcast, so I have my Tech World podcast with my latest episode, 4 clicks, 15 clicks for the other one before that, and you can switch to a plain list view if you like that, but, um, so yeah, you can even put YouTube feeds in there, which I'll show you in a second, but, uh, it's really simple, all you have to, you can log in with your Twitter account, I believe, um, and then you just have to go to create new feed, and I believe it even has integration for Facebook, so it's really cool. So I'm going to create the new feed, I'm just going to let it load, alright, and then you select which account you want to push off you, uh, you know, the feed to, so you can set it to your Facebook or your Twitter, or if you already have your Twitter to push off to your Facebook, which some people have, like me, uh, so that when my status on Twitter changes, it changes my Facebook status, so I only have to push it to one service. So I'm going to say, uh, you can authenticate using uh, OA, O authenticate, or if you already set up your Twitter account, you can just select which one you want to use, continue to step two the feed and I'm gonna set it to YouTube uh, let's see Laker cool man I'll say because that's my main channel now for your YouTube RSS feed it's really simple all you have to do is go to your YouTube channel so this is mine right here click the RSS button up here and hit subscribe to RSS and then just take this API feed right here this is using YouTube's API and the up it shows the uploads by whatever account you're going to go back to the Twitter feed account Paste it in, hit test RSS feed to make sure it's active and working. And you want to click active for it to actually, you know, post out there. Then you want to make sure you go into your advanced settings. And then you can check the update frequency, so every hour how much it posts. And I'll say, uh, yeah, check every hour. And I'll say, you can post up to one update at a time. I'll say you can post up to two updates. So maybe I uploaded two videos in the last hour. So go ahead and, you know, post out two videos uh, at a time if I upload more than, you know, one. Uh, that's probably, especially, uh, you want to set that higher if you run a blog with multiple writers on it, because multiple people will be writing within the hour, so, yeah. And I'm going to say include title and description, or title only, I'm going to say include the title only, that way it doesn't take up too much of the Twitter. I'll say short and links through Bitly, that way you can track it, and you can go into your Bitly settings and use your API login if you have one for Bitly. And then post items based on publish date, so the latest, obviously, you want the latest re uh, relevant uh, content and p uh, post prefix. So I'll say new video colon. So I'll just say new video. Post suffix comment rate subscribe. And you have a max of characters you can use. You see there, I already hit the maximum for this one. So maybe I even spelled comment wrong. So I may want to take those. Uh, see now I might have to find a way to uh, fit this all in because. Obviously, you won't be able to, so comment rate. See, I can fit it in like that, but then it'll be one big word. Uh, so maybe I'll just say subscribe and rate. Or you can even put, you know, comment rate, subscribe, CRS, whatever. For now, I'll just put subscribe and rate, or comment and rate, because most likely they're subscribed to you. Sorry, sorry about that. I mean, you know, you got to be... Uh, you know, you really decide what you want to put on these prefixes and suffixes. This may, because this is going to be pushed out to all your Twitter followers. Uh, you can keyword filter so you can separate multiple words with a space. Apple orange will match any post that contains the term apple or orange. So it kind of sorts out and filters your uh, tweet just like it would in a, you know, an email program. And you have some optional UTM tags if you want to mess around with those too. Uh, and that's pretty much all I want to mess with. I'm going to say create feed. And it should... After a little bit, just wait, it's creating that feed. And you should scroll down, and there it is, YouTube.com, YouTube like your cool man. 
and I'll be pushing out to my Twitter. So again, you can use this for YouTube links. You see there, the, twi- uh, the stats are kind of pulsing around. Uh, podcasts, especially, are really cool. Blogs, I mean, the possibilities are really cool with this because this way when you're not even tweeting, you know, you'll see tweets, for example, a couple uh, hours ago posted out. New blog post, must have productivity apps for the iPhone t- or iPod Touch. And you can even see here, check out my new video, Tech Unboxing. So that's, you know, it has that set up. And, you know, there's a whole bunch of other stuff you can check out. Uh, I have, I've posted a couple, I mean, and it even says from Twitter feed right there. So, guys, this is a really cool way to push out updates using uh, feeding from your art blog or any RSS feed to your Twitter. Hope you enjoy it. Check it out, twitterfeed.com, and follow me at Twitter on twitter.com slash kidguru. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe. Catch you guys later.